Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix the problem with the software update. Install now button is gray out on, uh, on your iPhone running iOS uh, 14. So you can see here I'm trying to um, install the update, but it's, the button is gray out and I cannot tap on it. Now there are several reasons that could cause the install now button to uh, gray out. In this instance, you can see it says here, this update requires at least 50% of battery. So this problem is quite straightforward. All you have to do is plug in uh, your power source. So plug in the lightning cable and that will allow the phone to uh, install if there is a power source. I'm just gonna turn on my battery. And there it is. Uh, my uh, battery appears to be running low as well. I'm just gonna turn the plug around just to make sure. Okay, so I'm just plugging into my charger, my um, uh, portable battery, and the battery is running low. So it, you can see it's a install now button is gray out. Okay, I'm going to remove it from the power bank and put it into my plug. Okay, let's have a look now. So now you can see the install now button become uh, active and you can tap on it. Now another thing that can cause uh, the button to gray out is the space. Uh, check your storage space. So you can go into the about section and make sure that you have enough uh, capacity uh, or the available capacity uh, to install the update. Another thing that you can check is your internet connectivity. Make sure that you are connected to a Wi-Fi uh, so that uh, your phone can per download the, the update and perform the installation. And if those of the things that cannot fix uh, the installer button, then what you can do is try to uh, plug your phone into your computer and you can try the update through iTunes. But I'm pretty sure if you do what I've said just then, you, know, you should be able to fix uh, the problem with the install now button is being grayed out. So if I tap on install now, I can put in my screen passcode and this will allow me to proceed with the update. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video and good luck with your fix. Thank you for watching.